the different communication styles of different folks impact us enormously. Fellow Toastmasters and dear guests, I can recall vividly on my first day at college, I entered into classroom with a lot of hesitancy and nervousness. And as I sat in the second bench, there was a guy next to me named Lakshman. And with a few questions, he broke the ice between us as to from where I was or what are my hobbies and the things that I love doing and many other such questions. And sometimes, and I was, and I was immediately drawn to him due to, due to his enthusiastic personality. And sometimes, when I sit alone in the class, he always used to come up and take initiative to talk to me. This made me more open to him and we soon became good friends. Can any of you guess what type of communicator he is? Well, he is an initiative communicator. Overall, the communication style of an initiative communicator made me feel energetic and also active. And as I progressed to third year of my college, I was always having this doubt of what to do next. Should I go for a job or higher studies? And what I did was I went around asking people I knew. I asked my family, <coughs> friends and relatives and all I got was the pieces of conflicting advice. And I didn't know what to do. And by the time I realized that I had to take an entrance exam <coughs> in order to do higher studies, it was late. I was so worried and kind of depressed and almost gave up on the exam since I had less time to prepare. But one day, when I was discussing this with one of my friends, Sandhya, the way she began talking to me and boosting my confidence made a lot of difference. She started reminding me of all the times when we tackled the exams no matter how much less time we had to prepare. And she also started kind of mentoring me by giving the key concepts that might appear in the exam. And this gave me a little hope and showed me possibilities in achieving a good run. And can you guess what type of communicator she is? She is a supportive communicator and overall the communication style of a supportive communicator made me feel valued and heard. Fast forward to the time when I started working. One day our manager asked our team to give him a new date for completing a task and I replied right away saying sir, it will take me 5 days to complete the task. However, when it was my colleague Narendra's turn, for a while and then said, Sir, it will take me seven days to complete the task. When I heard that, I felt kind of weird. And guess what happened? It took Narendra exactly seven days to complete the task while I was still working on the task. And as I pondered, I understood that the short process can help you process information better and analyze them better. And that is what helped Narendra in giving such a precise duty. Can you guess what type of communicator he is? He is an analytical communicator. Overall, the communication style of an analytical communicator made me feel astonished and inspired. How do you think I communicate? What type of communication style do I have? Well, using the TI learning program, I discovered that my primary style of communication is direct. Which means, while I communicate, I prefer when you come to the point quickly and in a succinct manner. <coughs> and the one style that I am looking forward to developing is analytical. So my friends, when will you start pondering on your communication style?